this again. This here is Bucky O'Hare for NES. Our goal here is to beat the game. And the quest is being submitted by the Mollusk. Here we go. Hello there, Moon Pie. Hello and welcome. Man, this game has such awesome music. Blinky is captured on the green planet, the Deadeye is sent to the red planet. Jenny is held on the blue and Will is held on the yellow. Your friends are mine. You're next. By Harris by a Harris whiskey. Now he must save his loyal crew. Enslaved by terrible toads. It's really weird that you charge your jump by holding down the fire button. Yeah, they're just green planets. Really no need to give them any more identity than that. Life was so much easier. Man, the controls in this game is um, so damn good. They're just like, they're just right, that's the thing. Like the controls are just right, they're super tight. The Bucky O'Hare universe has tons of named planets? Oh shit! hard jumping on these things, apparently. It looks like you can cheat your way forward there, but I don't know. I knew there was a TV series, I didn't know there was a comic. But it was one of those that sometimes were broadcasted on Saturday mornings around here. Ha! Quick route. How do you... How do you get that one up? Oh. I don't know how this game is with continues and stuff. I guess I fall down?
And I just hope to get lucky to catch something on the way down. Hmm, found something. Maybe over here? Oh. Okay, I can't shoot those. You can see the, these lasers charging up a little bit, but... Hmm, I wonder if I can... Yeah. I don't know what having more power charge actually does. Wait, maybe I can... Oh. Got him. I gotta increase the font size a little bit of the chat window here. Should chat be in pixels? No. The font size. Like. 18. Okay, that's good. A rocket pack, Captain O'Hare, allowing. Oh. LNT. LNT. I hope the volume levels are fine. By the way, how do I switch character? Oh, okay. There we go. Oh shit! Sound levels are good. Okay, that's good to know. Enjoy the hot jams here. Oh shit. <laughs> I really need to up this creature's power. Man, the the stun locks from getting hit is rough. <laughs> ah, it's ridiculous. Does it stop falling after a while? Okay, it does. Just dodge the four pieces that fall and then run.
might be enough. Nice. Yeah, I figured something like this was up. Shit. Ah. Oh. <laughs> this this is pretty damn evil. It feels very much like a, you kind of need to know this area, lest you're gonna die. <laughs> Can I continue? I heard you like Quick Man? Exactly. It's like, yeah, we've seen that Quick Man stage, but what if it was worse? Wouldn't that be... That'd be fun, right? Shit! At least you get to continue right here, so... It's not that bad. Right, I kind of need to count, it seems like. Left, right, down, left, right, left, right, left. Ah, shit! That part is so difficult! It's like they're taunting you just a tad there. And, and I keep thinking... So I know at like the big drop I'm supposed to hold right. But... <laughs> It's so hard to remember which of the big drops. Too early again, because there's like a couple of big drops there. Got through it. This is just an incredibly well-made game, really. Oh, Jesus. What is going on? I'm guessing these spikes insta-kills you.
Oh! Look at that. Oh, because this character is a little bit shorter. Probably makes this easier. That help though. I did not consider that. The flying is far too short to get across there. for really Are they just score I think so I gotta go by a small rock? Nope. Wait, what? How do you... Wait, how do I do this? Can I duck here? That one... Okay, I would have made it past... <laughs> Screw it. Not worth it. Oh, come on! So not fair. Oh shit, I gotta... I forgot that it came, comes around here. All right, and then you you have to jump this first platform here. Okay. Uh, 
Okay. I mean, it doesn't deal much damage. But he does insta-kill you. I don't know if he's gonna come across again. Got him. I wonder if you can one cycle that boss. A really boring background from this angle. <laughs> It's a toad blaster which I just lifted from a toad arsenal. No problem zapping around in this rock toad rocket pack. Zoom right over the toad walls. MNKAJ. Ah, uh, ice physics. Don't you just hate it? Wait, no one else can break this? When are you supposed to do this if you don't got this dude? Maybe you have to de destroy them in certain certain orders or tiers, but I can select. Weird. It's also a bit interesting that everyone has their own energy bar, but we share health bar. I suspect that there would be something of value in there. Hey, it's Battletoad Snake! Oh shit! Except they insta kill you. Arts. I knew that was gonna happen. I freaking knew he was gonna turn back for me. I saw that shit coming a mile away. God, this ice physics works weird. So 
the ice physic basically works that you keep your momentum for a few moments after you release the, the forward button. But you do it even if you're in air. Most games you can cheese or like fake your way out of ice physics by uh, by simply um, by simply like jumping. It, it usually works, but not in this game because the ice physics persists through through area movement. Game's impossible as a kid. Maybe I, I didn't have it as a kid. Wait, what? Wait, I don't get it. I don't get it. <laughs> well, those kills you. That's... Those are also spikes, apparently. What is the game trying to tell me? Oh, that's how you stop the ice physics. You just press down. Can't break the ground or something like that, right?
Oh, wait, what? I kinda don't get what happened. But apparently it worked. I think I shot the blocks so that the spike ball hit the ground. Yeah, exactly, but I thought I had like... It felt like I had tried that already, but apparently not. I don't know if I need to tell everyone how much this segment sucks. Okay, I got past. That was gonna happen, but I really want to see what's up there. I don't know if I'll actually. That's just because they started to hide shit in these things. If they never started doing that, I wouldn't be curious. I am totally blaming the game for, for, for me dying. It's a perfect bait, I know. I hate it. I'm so susceptible to it.
This is a pretty cool boss in that he like slowly freezes the floor. Keeps pushing you upwards towards those spikes. Stuck in the ice seems to guarantee you get hit. Okay, you can't you can duck under those. Ah, shit! You can only, you can't you can't duck under the mid the mid height ones. This is the freeze. Ah, shit. Freeze. Shit. There's like no space left. Fuck! <laughs> they got you, Tudori. Shit, I'm sorry. Got him. It's everyone. Gets everyone eventually. I mean, I still have to work as well. I can work from home. Should I need to. But I can actually still go to the office. I croak all the toads with my beam blaster and tow the turbo ball. M8 V2G M8 E2G Man, playing on a CRT is so damn nice. Our company is actually super early with sending everyone home. They were basically like, everyone can work from home if they want to. And I was like, but I don't want to. Ah, you don't have to. Oh well, fair enough. But it kind of settles the discussion, at least on that, in my team, or in my company, like, can we all work from home? Like, apparently. Seems to work pretty fine so far.
Uh, that lady really needs to get a power up. Mind control ball. Oh shit, those hurt you. Oh. Oh, what a pain. Alright, so the blue ones are just background. That's good. this thing? Yes. So I'm, I'm assuming these blue things are platforms here. Oh. Guess not. <laughs> oh. Oh, these rocks aren't dangerous. I thought the foreground rocks were gonna damage me. Oh shit! Okay, you can stand on these things. Okay, that's really damn cool, actually. Oh! <laughs> Flying on these rocks seems super dangerous. You also don't really know where the when the rocks are gonna cease, like stop carrying you. Okay, so you gotta catch that rock, that one. I want Psychic Lady to have this. Whoa, pop, 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 pop. It's really hard to spot what's going on. I saw we passed the cart, yep. This is pretty impressive. How well made it is. Ah, so we're gonna have to do this again. Yet again? Come on! <laughs> Freaking bullshit. <laughs> that 
That's such BS. I think you could jump up to the upper carts directly there. Like you could probably skip the going back part if you time your jump perfectly. And jump straight up there. Oh! <laughs> Indeed. Indeed, Jay. It's really weird as well, because your momentum doesn't carry over if you jump off of these things while they're moving at high speed. Ah, shit. It was too late. I wonder if I could have flown directly all the way to there. Probably. I'm going to have to jump over some spikes, aren't I? I knew it! The skips. All right, new theory here. Okay, I did not expect it to stop there and take my charging away. Okay, that's probably not worth it. But it is pretty cool. Oh, I got to keep my charge this time. Hmm, weird. This part is pretty damn long. How nice of them. How was I supposed to know that? I guess I weren't. Can't I destroy that thing?
Ah, so it does open its mouth pretty slow, actually. I'm guessing I'm supposed to target the upper thing. <sighs> no heads up. Right, this duck gun doesn't seem to deal much damage, does it? I thought it was pretty clever there, but apparently not. for that strat.
Of course, it's the eye last. Got him. Fair and square. While I was held captive, I kept busy putting together a new weapon. It's my one shot does it all blaster. You can call it the thumber. If you press the fire button longer, it just gets stronger. Brought this brave crew together again. Oh no, it's a trick which the toads set to capture Bucky O'Hare. Oh no! No, we get tricked! Wake up, Blinky. We're trapped in a toad mother ship. They're taking my crew for sport. We must save the crew before... Milik. style all of a sudden now? I'm well, not like open world but you know like big exploration stage kind of that's pretty cool I don't need more power Life is always nice. Wait, what? Power lines dealt a lot of damage. I couldn't destroy them either. Ah! No, I ain't playing your games. Oh! Whoa, whoa. Oh shit, she's mind controlled. No. I don't want to kill you, but you leave me no choice. Oh shit, she 
deals a lot of damage. Why am I shooting the prisoners? Because the prisoners are shooting me. No, they're, they're, I don't know. Oh shit, that thing actually hurts you. Jesus, that scared me. Hey, unworry. I'm kind of the opinion that the prison has started it. The only aggro after you shoot? That's what they want you to think. That's part of the prisoner's conspiracy. Bosses in this game, in general, can take far too much damage. There we go. I've lost myself in a hypnosis beam. Okay. So how is everything with unwary today? I didn't miss a host or so? No. Pretty certain I know what's gonna happen with these. Right? Yeah. No oh, sh I didn't see those, they were freaking red. Now I gotta find the ugly duckling. Flashing means they have several different faces, I guess. How are they moving a circle? Probably what it means. I like this part of the game. It's actually pretty cool. You have to go explore this big base to find your units again. I 
I mean, it, it's pretty well known that it's a very good game, but it's worth repeating that it is a very good game. Do you see, if, if my shots hit the absolute edge, they just slide off. I think that's actually a really cool effect. Someone must have spent a lot of time implementing. lose your footing sometimes though for no apparent reason. Where was it? really know Is that the only thing he does oh shit Did I maybe caught at the top? Could I have gone up here? No, right. I guess... No, I don't think so, right. My thought was basically to position myself at the top here and then shoot him down. What is this guy's power? Oh, he probably shoots a stronger beam. I mean, of course, yay, didn't you know? Yeah, like if your friends don't behave, you shoot them until they do. This one go upward here. Wait, how? Oh, I gotta, I gotta bucky that part. Strict crew discipline. <laughs> yeah.
Bucky rules with an iron fist. He's known throughout the ga galaxy as the iron, the iron hair. Let P, this dude needs it. Well, we got it at least. And they persist. They persist over game over, so it doesn't matter. Alright, see you around, Jidori. Have a good night. Try not to go nuts. That was sloppy. down there. I don't know. Wait, what? Come on. I fell for it. Apparently. You gotta like slide your thumb off of that jump. <laughs> there you go. I guess this is how you're supposed to do it. Uh, 
Uh, at least they're really gen generous with the continues in this game. I got baited again! Goddamn frog! <laughs> Shit! <laughs> Apex predators. <laughs> It must be, yeah. In the beginning, the universe was created. This made a lot of people very angry and has been widely regarded as a bad move. Fighting these frogs from above is really tricky, given the constraints you have to move. This section is long. Really damn long. How you doing, Goro? Finally. What are we merging you with? Uh, what was it? A, a Slobleth? Or something like that? I don't remember the exact name of that thing, but I think it was called a Slobleth. That's what we considered merging you with. But we did conclude in the end that it wasn't worth it. Captain! What shall we do? We have to escape! Are we now? I calculate we're near the core of the magma tanker. Let's follow the salvage chute down to the center, then we can blow their tanks. Let's ionize the slime-eating toadies. 
Damn. Yeah, good rolls. Six, five, five, six. Being a really evil DM, isn't that the best? But have you put the poor souls through? You're playing D and D five, right? If I recall correctly. Something tells me these are insta kill. Just, just a general feeling, you know. Yep. V20 hunters. Okay. I wonder why some have like super many spikes and some just have a few. I wonder if they kill you like different amounts. One like super dead and one is just like a, a tad dead. Yeah, I guess Van Helsing is a pretty good comparison to the hunter system. our way through here. What the fuck? <laughs> Did Van Helsing have superpowers? I actually don't remember that. You bait these out and then they're done or possible to jump over them, it's just really, really tight. By the way, see that most of the something something V something M, the V20, M20, Werewolf 20, and Changeling 20 were free. Uh, a couple of days ago. Oh, voting has opened. Shall we continue to play Bucky O'Hare? 
for the NES. Get your votes in, everyone. Get your votes in. I don't think it's too far to go, no. So either exclamation mark yes, or exclamation mark no, or use those handy dandy emotes of yours. Yeah, I I gotta say I'm a I'm such a sucker for the mage system, and like mage twenty is oh, it's so well written. Oh, I'm so happy. I want them to make a fifth edition of mage, but if this is all I'm getting, I'm really happy. I've always thought mage was their most interesting system because it's just so damn weird. It's in the making. It's perfect. I just love the freedom you have in the mage system. It just it takes so long to get players to understand just how completely overpowered and broken they are. And once they realize they you usually use those powers to kill themselves. Because basically, the, the, the basis of the system is that you're you're able to freely manipulate the purview of reality. Not freely, but more... pretty freely. Exactly, as long as they're not seen by muggles, you're more or less free to alternate reality as you see fit. Well, this part sucks. Where does this pipe end? This one ends right about here, but where's the next one oh, over there? That's the end of the screen. How do I make it from here? So where is the next platform? Oh, there it is. Shit. God damn it. I guess we voted to continue anyway. That makes me happy. What? 22.45? Really? Oh damn. Time flies when you're having fun, eh? Where does this ground end? Where does the next one begin? Wait, there's gotta be something out oh, there. Whoever thought this was a great idea? Ugh. Where does this one end? What? <laughs> How do you get past Tangelanus? Boss. 
Welp. The fuck? <laughs> Imagine if this game didn't have infinite continues. Okay. And now what? I broke the crystal and then what? Then just hit the toad. <sighs> Hitting this Kinesis ball is... Like placing it at the correct spot is pretty tricky. Yeah, the just part is... Oh. You just hit the toad. I'm gonna be stored here. I gotta blow this two-bit tanker, guys. Okay, it's actually pretty far left, it looks like. Central Magma Tanker, Act 1. Uh... Really? <laughs> Fucking really? <laughs> Indeed. Imagine if this game didn't have infinite continues. Oh, I gotta go that way. Though, listen to the music. The music is freaking amazing.
I wasn't even close to the spikes. How do I get across here? Come on! Alright, can someone just quickly look up, is there a password for getting back to center of magma core? Wait, I gotta get across all the way? Okay, got it. M9... LZ, okay. Yeah, but that at least means there's a... There's a... There's a password for getting back to this stage. And that's kind of like all I need. To know that I'm... I'll be fine if I... <laughs> I love these TVs in the background. Ah, the jams on this stage. What? <laughs> really? Ah. 
Did they have to put the spikes up there? They just fucking had to, didn't they? Oh shit! Screw him. I did not expect the double hit. Okay, so I can't, I can't run past them, but I apparently can't shoot them either. Or can I? How am I supposed to handle them? I guess that works. Ah, oh, shit! Two of them. the one up. Let's get the next part. <laughs> Man, this is so evil. Like design wise this game is amazing. They get you get to play to all your characters. What does P do? Uh, P increases your um, You see the power bar I got at the bottom there? Like that gauge. That gauge decides how long I can use my character's special abilities for. And the P ability uh, increases that bar, but I have uh, everyone at max already, so. I guess that would be the one thing that like goes away if I game over completely. Then I would have to like collect it all again. Which would be something of a pain. Or like if I if I use the continue code. But hey, I think I gotta end it here. It's eleven o'clock. I'm getting through this today. So, thank you all for watching, hope you had a good time, this game, this game is really good.